Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. I'm here. You all right? <clears throat> Fine. <clears throat> I just needed a breather. Sounded like you blew your guts airlock. Ah, <sighs> yeah. I barfed. It's just stress. Esa chamba te va a matar. Don't worry. I'm not dead yet. Exactly. Yet. Anyway, what's going on? Is there a problem? <clears throat> we had a leak. My boss called. Dragged me in because we had to intervene. Everyone at Night City HQ is on edge. But no way you're fucked, right? You're the one who fixes other people's shit. Jackie, if you work in Arasaka Counter Intel, you're always fucked. Don't worry about me. I'll manage on my own. Buena suerte. You think Japan will find out? About what? About Frankfurt. I mean, it's a small leak, but still. Japan already knows. Where'd you hear this? Saka's counterintelligence division effectively secures a corporate summit in Jakarta. The year of great change in our history. The onset of American prohibition. The end of World War I. And the birth of Saburo Arasaka. From an early age, Saburo was heavily involved in the business his father had founded. Christ, As a young man, supposed to be he quickly demonstrated ago. the work ethic and natural talent. Got held up, but I'll be right there. Manager. Fucking Frankfurt. That is, until that Abernathy his bitch will probably dump it in our laps. By Ugh, hanging up. Doorstep. I'll be in my office. Saburo Arasaka you hurry up. As a pilot in the Nippon Kaigun, the Japanese Imperial Navy. By the age of 23, he had already achieved the rank of lieutenant. With 20 confirmed aerial victories, he forever will be Militech had three of ours. Mr. Jenkins asked for you. He's in his office. Hey, V. It's been ages. It's me, Frank. We met during Icefall. East Coast, remember? I didn't know you were in Night City. How have you been? Ah, uh, you know how it is. A week ago, I was still in Cape Town. I heard you encounter intel. Must have a shit show on your hands right now after Frankfurt. Jenkins is your lead, right? Is he what everyone says he is? Tell me about the op in Cape Town. Operation Cargo. You know about it? Arming local conflicts in Africa. I didn't know those you. It was me. We dumped crates full of rifles into the ocean. They had to be pulled out using borrowed fishing boats. Same old circus, but hey, that's how wars are won. And you, who do you work under? Abernathy. She's really good. Came up with the whole Cape Town ploy on her own. Abernathy? The bitch who burned my boss on the promotion to Spec Ops Director. You know how it is. Things happen. Mm. They do indeed. What does everyone say about Jenkins? That he's effective. Like any psychopath. Apparently, he's gone a little crazier lately. Hey, he's in a tough spot. The director was supposed to greenlight his promotion when the Japanese arrived. She stabbed him in the back instead. Listen, sorry, I'm in a bit of a rush right now. We'll talk another time, okay? Sure, sure. Good seeing you again. Emergency protocols active. System security confirmed. Don't look. That's her. Jenkins girl. Hi. 
Please enter the antechamber. Are you online? Have a seat, V. Be right with you. We have to handle this voting issue before we lose our bases in the Sea of Clouds. They're about to begin. What's the situation? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just as we thought. You know what to do. Start now. Director Abernathy. I watched the vote. What the hell was that? The deep clean after the shit Frankfurt dumped on us. As we agreed, I got rid of the problem. I told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? We would have lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. We're not done talking about this. I hate that bitch. I always have. Always meaning how long? Before Night City, we worked on an assignment in Osaka. Two years of subterfuge. She spent them digging a trap for me. When she became the director of Spec Ops. And that's when she finally shot me in it. Now she's holding a gun to my head to make sure I don't try anything. But she won't pull the trigger because she needs me. I do what she doesn't have the guts to do. Divide and conquer. Effective strategy. <sighs> Effective. What would you do in my position? You have to defend yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doormat. You're right. Smack her once, but hard. She'll respect you. Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. Take this. A data shard. Proof of my trust. Go on, take it. It's what I've collected over the past weeks. Biometrics, trauma team card, names of her closest associates. Driver, chief of security, lover, lover's husband, everything. Use it and make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said it. I need to defend myself. If anyone finds out we even talked about this, I'll go down with you. That's true. But everyone knows you only made it to where you are thanks to me. So it's not like they could ever believe you played no part in it. What'll happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. This isn't a request, V. We seem to understand each other. Take this, too. Predship transactions are traceable. Paper disappears as soon as you spend it. What can I say? Use this money only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate affiliation. And for the core task, use someone you know inside out. Are we clear? Yeah. I think we're clear. Good. In that case, I'll await your report. And good luck with it. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. And don't disappoint me. Jenkins, Night City counter -intel. I have those reports you asked for? I don't have the time. Just send them my way. AV, you alive? How's things in the Viper P? Viper pit. Yeah. Couldn't have said it better. You in some trouble? Not yet. Just need a soul I can trust for now. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour.
I need your stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Is it Frankfurt again? No, different issue. Local. Tell me. Quick version. Our agent at Biotechnica suspects they might be on to him. They recently granted him red security clearance. That's Tom. He's been fishing for dirt, but it's been slow. Your point? They're clean. Like we run orphanages clean. Bleached server clean. We suspect they flagged him and are feeding him phony data. Should we green light Exfil or let him keep looking? Projected risks? Limited threat to life. Not Biotechnica style. Blackmail's possible. Leveraged against false accusations in the media. The guy has kids. He'd crack. Pull him out, but calmly. Don't raise any eyebrows. Otherwise, they'll catch on. Jenkins will be livid. I'll handle Jenkins. Understood. They'll be searching for dirt on us now. Lunar bases are huge to them. They won't save us. You see the report on the boat? I mean, shit. The world's going to be so hard. Access granted. Please provide your destination. Bring up district analytics. Increased NCPD presence and activity has been reported in Haywood. No official statement has been forthcoming. Intercepted radio communications suggest MaxTag has been sent to the area. A widespread power failure has been reported in Santo Domingo. All other districts exhibit activity within expected parameters. Destination, Lizzie's Bar. Noted. En route. Scheduled to connect until the end of the week. Quantified Satori received notification of a somewhat troubling biometric reading. I felt I should call. Is everything in order? Things are dandy. Everything is. Just think back to our last session. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day, they'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. Sure, okay. See you later.
Find a spot close to the bar. As close as you can. Fuck procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. Compared to you, could have fucking crushed us. Oh, okay, no, no, hey, we, we ain't looking for no beef with you. Seems trouble wants in. Oh, hey, why is this Keep happening? an eye on the AV for me, will ya? I don't get paid to do that. I wasn't asking. And not a scratch on it when I get back. Welcome to Lizzie's. Too, Jack. How you been? We got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and Maelstrom. Eddie's there for the taking. As long as you don't get flatlined. Yeah, you know how it is. Can't complain, but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. Let me hear about this problem of yours. Jackie, before I start, this stays between us. Por supuesto. Serious. This thing, it, it could ruin me. So could I. You do realize what you're talking to, right? The guy who's done this before. Remember what happened in Mexico, at the border? Keep one word. I know. You saved my ass. The word about the cartels had gotten out. But it didn't. And this won't either. That's why you came to see dear old Jackie. Data shard. Take it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Won't come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie. Maybe two. A runner with a gold-plated brain. And a driver with wheels from hell. Not to mention a solo. Mm hmm. The piece I'm missing. That what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? Delicate situation, I know. That's why I need somebody I can trust. This ain't no delicate situation, Emma. It's a hit job. Plain and simple. You know how Arasaka operates. Or Okay, maybe you don't. This isn't a professional request I can refuse. But I can. And I am. You should too. Now, what do you say we lick her up to talk life? That's his mamita. Double tequila with grenadine and lime. Nothing better for drowning nerves. Do this. Was that a toast? What the hell does that even mean? Raise a glass to your mama, your hermana. To the mamacita you'll meet at the bar. But this doesn't say a damn thing. <laughs> to this. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. You know what it is? Un pacto con el diablo. Been saying it all along. Sell your soul to those Arizaka fuckers. Today? They got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. Think I have a choice? If I refuse, they take everything. 
and leave me nothing. Yeah, well, let them. They'll also take the fist they got gripping your balls. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty picky about who I let touch my balls. And Saburo and his matones, oh, they definitely do not make the cut. Maybe someday. But for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always be. Hey, you lost? Got a problem? V, is that right? Did Jenkins send you? Don't believe I know you. You don't. We know you very well. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. No, don't believe I will. That's between me and Jenkins. <clears throat> Fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. The data, now. <clears throat> Information's on the shard. Smart choice. We done? With the formalities, yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our feet for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up. You're coming with us. Come on, move Wait it. Wait a minute. I think you fellows might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm not sure this body was your style, let alone a healthy option. Is that a threat? Well, you start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? Before you know it, somebody might die today. We have what we came for. We don't do for now. Dodge one there. Dodge another. V, how you feel? You all right? Regulators. By Oman and sad analysis system. Body's gotta adjust. Hey. Hey. Should I get you to a ripper? Or I guess maybe drama team's on its way. TT policy's gone, Jack. So are my biochem controllers. Company pad. I mean, they ceased. My bank account, not frozen, ceased. Jesus, these fuckers move fast. You sure you feel okay, though? I mean... Give me a minute. Get my shit together. <clears throat> That'd be that, Jack. Just lost control of my life. Completely. I'd say you got it back. You couldn't say no to them. So they said it to you. This is a turn for the better. You'll see. Besides, you haven't lost everything. I have to say, I, I still have a friend. That's sweet. <laughs> no, dumbass. You still got that wad for the hit job, don't you? Probably some fat ass chunk of cha chang. Just right for a new start. That's right, Chica. Buckle up. Hey. You hearing all right? Don't look so hot. V! V! Hey, hermana. Your new life. It starts now. Hello there, Night City! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams. I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals. But only half these gods will survive a year. And that's if it's a good one. 
And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan Blackhand and Waylon Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the bounty, kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you live, the faster you burn out. If you don't get a bullet to the brain first. NC's legends. Know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard. Matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of dreams. Chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which... Got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to, uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Militech. Jack, we're talking classified military-grade tech here. How did you get it? Debug. And our girl made a couple adjustments. Why? Thinks she knows better? Nah. Said it didn't suit her, uh, style. <laughs> You'll see what I mean. Not now, Jack. No time. Maybe later. Sure, sure. Mañana. Mañana. Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Sha. Yeah. Let's do this. Elevator, this way. Target's Sandra Dorset. Target's Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Bug. Could at least try to be... nice. You want nice, supportive? Call a damn helpline. Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking.
Got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomon. Need to know what we're dealing with. Oh, this She's in a tub of ice. Crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Heard people who live through shit like this get panic attacks. Without ever knowing why. You'll be sipping a glass of ice cold water. Suddenly, your hands shaking. V, jack into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomon working, checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, V. Do your thing. Oh, fuck! She's flatlining! V! Need to know what's Jackie going on. Jackie, air hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Catch, chica. I think. Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, chica. Get her outside. Mm. Scav rats abandoned the ship. Must have seen trauma. Decided to cut their losses. Back now. Team 
ET-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secure. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Greenwich. yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. She'll get Wakako on the hollow. Tell her the job's done. <clears throat> v, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. Not relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the corridor, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Chica. I'm driving. Legends are born in your brain. Get up in your brain. Send in your train. Send in your scully in the gullies, yeah. Bully in the burrows, oh. Yeah, take a starving. Body, yeah. Let's that grab a tight bite. What do you say? Way too Jackie, you're locking down Watson, remember? Stops. 
What does the lockdown do for the nerdy? Necessary security measures. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you? Really? What is it that makes you so special? Uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show you. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. Waiting. That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. Let them through. But they don't laugh. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. She took a liking to you. The motion I demonstrated, grabbed a tool of attack. Right. I'm loyal, stable in my affections. Mm -hmm. And unassuming. You get it. Give me the two, give me the five, give me the O. Two, five, boom, banging on your back door. Give me the two, give me the five, give me the O. about you? Not likely to make it back to Hayward. Kill me? Now let me through. Sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice guy. I said hi. I will. Hey, Luego. Hey, Luego. Night City, expect the unexpected. Good evening, Night City. My first guest tonight Bye. is the president of the I church. Earlier. The runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deeds. Praise be to me, our Father in heaven. And our second guest is Karina Lee, host of the Chip In program, which promotes the use of cybernetic implants. How about treating you, beautiful? Can't complain, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. Now. Oh, stupid gates busted again. Third time.
Whoa, V? You get your beauty sleep? <laughs> no matter. Time you got up. I think I might have caught something. When I jacked into that corpo's biome on. I know a neurovirus or... I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. Hey, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How did you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Shit. Come you on! Call me a collector. Later, oh, no, no, no. I'm not afraid you know of any. The worst no. thing is about this place. Wait, give me 14 a day? Man, that's different. No. The fucking smell. <laughs> How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next-gen ass whooping, he did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of me. So how about it? Where'd you get him, Fred? Off the street. Saw him looking up at me with these big, sad eyes. So I took the poor pup in, fed him, clothed him. <laughs> nah. For real, he's a military box. Got a sweet deal, and a tumor mine tossed in a few upgrades. Now, here we are. How's it going? Fight's about to start. Not gonna watch? Take notes? Malone versus Hernandez? <laughs> nah, our chrome friend here don't watch TV. Don't talk, neither. The only way he communicates is with them fists. Let's do this. Light on your feet. Get that head moving. You got one hell of a punch there, Tim. Ever thought of monetizing it? I can arrange a fight or two. What do you say? You go in the rain yourself? Not anymore. Skull's taking too much of a beating. Reflexes ain't what they used to be. There's ways of fixing that. Karenza cops should do the trick. Rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. You mentioned something about fighting? Hmm. I've seen you landing blows in the rain. You've got sharp instinct, good edge. You can go far, especially if you get chipped. These fights, let's just say they aren't leap. But very lucrative. Lucrative for who? You or me? Both of us. 
I get a small percentage of the total winnings. You know, as your agent, you get the rest. Sounds fair. It's like I said. Good instinct. Fights happen in different parts of the city. You choose where you want to go. Put down your eddies and start swinging. You win, you take home the pot. Manage to drop every last one of them, you get a chance to fight in the grand finale. That all clear? Crystal. Good. Oh, except you won't be setting foot outside or what? Not yet. You can start. I believe in you, V. Time to show this city what you're made of. V! The sweet little 45 is waiting for its mommy. Hers after every shot now. Let's have a look. Thanks a lot. Luxury has become a den for violent gangs and drug addicts. Hello, it's time for your local news. The Aratama Matsuri Festival is nearly upon us. To mark the event, the streets of Night City will come alive with exquisite multi-story dashi floats. The festival program will also include musical performances by Biwa virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And, in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you... So, uh, what are we going to talk about yesterday? Now, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Didn't figure you as the type for Asian. I thought you'd find it too exotic. What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Synth sirloin? Check. Get some more chile action up in here, and you're looking at Mama Wells' signature sopa de fideos. <laughs> Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or...? Just had a brain fart. Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Totally the top fixer in night fucking city. Badass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated coup. How did you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? As far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You know me? Oh, but T-Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on. Ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. 
Dexter Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? Know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacation. Right. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. What the hell was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas Adam in his mouth while jerking off to hardcore virtues. The important thing is he's back. Fresh crew found us. Choose space. Choose orbital air. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Well, our savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. No pressure, but... Old deal's riding on you now, chica. Are you? Promise you. This your life. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice, then. <laughs> Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is the leader of his own. Don't get me started. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, yo. Yeah, no. your wheels. Give them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust off with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Don't tell me that's a chicken. First stop, Ripper Dock. A chica, easy on the gas, eh? What was that? I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date. You don't say. So really gets me, you know. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once fixed up dust in your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. V! But you are not the masters of your memories! For your eyes do not belong to you, or rather, not me. Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Your mechanical you look pleased. I am. Always. Makes for easier living. Picky <laughs> spry as ever, you old ripper. Good to see you. Good to see you, too, Jake. A while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Oh, kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. Gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshaun. 
Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But Something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, in the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Roshi optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. Kuroshi, whoa! Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy, then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this... might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now? I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the tops of built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play-by-play, -play, though? <laughs> really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist, always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? OK. 
Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. The scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. You're the best, Vic. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra score on him. Absorb 75% of every blow. Got cash riding on this? Nah, just looking. <laughs> it's out of habit more than anything else. Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh... looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, and... yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk this up. What are you... V, listen, Do you I've got this stuff really in That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in this city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe that an uncooked therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tatty gets the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> My 
mind if I ask you something right off the bat? Would you rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. What the hell? Respect. No. No way. Sorry. All right. Listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Hang on. Got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past. And sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Hmm. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Miss V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow, cause we gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Client. What's her thing? Why does she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway. Our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say went, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy. What's he like? A straight psychopath. Chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that. Except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. Corpo agent, what's she playing at? Hell if I know. 
been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Hmm. Sounds like she was waiting on the transport. Got stood up. Monochrome in the back's probably her chief suspect. Got nothing from him or on him, so she's keeping him just in case. But she needs to find the stolen gear before her bosses learn she fucked up. Well, Miss V, that is some impressive deduction. Naturally, use that intel as you please. Preferably well. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Miss V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. About sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent, too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Chingon. Yeah, you don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Parker. Think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods, put my nose to the ground. like we found the last honest cop in this city. Her name's Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She'd do best to cut it out if you catch my drift. Okay, look, I know how it sounds, but somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. T-Bug sent me. Said you'd have something for me. You're V, right? She had me hold the demon for you. It should work on any third gen deck. Got a Militech Caroline. Think it'll do. Hmm. Solid gear. For a beginner. Okay. Glad to grab a demon always. You could test it now. I have an access point. If you'd like, that is. You might extract some shimsoft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, either way.
Thank <laughs> you.